from our Chicago studios. This is the Muslim News on Muslim Network TV. Assalamu alaikum. I'm Samana Siddiqui. Our top story tonight. A majority of American voters are pushing for a ceasefire in Gaza in contrast to the stance of most members of U.S. Congress. A recent poll by Data for Progress highlights a divergence between the mood of the American public and policymakers. According to the poll, 66% of likely voters believe the U.S. should call for a ceasefire and de-escalation of violence in Gaza. Jewish American group If Not Now, which has helped organize demonstrations for a ceasefire, stressed the importance of political leaders allying with their constituents to end the ongoing violence. 18 members of the House of Representatives have sponsored a resolution urging the Biden administration to support a ceasefire. It was introduced by Representatives Cory Bush and Rashida Tlaib. Despite these efforts, support for a ceasefire in Congress is holding up, prompting activists and a growing number of Capitol Hill staffers to advocate for change. In an open letter, more than 400 Muslim, Jewish and allied congressional staffers urged their employers to join calls for an immediate ceasefire between Israel and Hamas. More than 260 former employees of Senator Elizabeth Warren's 2020 presidential campaign have also called on the senator to support concrete steps to end the conflict. Senator Bernie Sanders, a leading progressive, has accused Israel of violating international law and called for restraint. He has stressed the need for an end to bombardment and rockets from both sides, the rapid delivery of humanitarian aid to Gaza, and the safe return of hostages.